going to set the storyline for Ultimate for a very, very long time. And like you said, Genesis Ultimate Mixing Pot, man. We got Japan. We got the European Penguins. We got, you know, <laughs> Europe. <laughs> oh, my God. We got right. South America. Everyone's coming out. Mexico. That's right. And, of course, we are on the American soil as well. So we have all these different kinds of metas. And we got all the top representatives from each country. That's so. right. Genesis just brings out the best of the best in the community. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. not saying other tournaments don't, but, yeah, I, you know, there's... You want to win Genesis, okay? Like, that's the ultimate bragging If you rights. get top eight at Genesis as a player, right. you are set. Yeah, you want <laughs> Genesis, EVO, these are tournaments that you want to place very, very well at. Um, but, but, yeah, like like you said, though, we had a pretty strong preseason, so on and so forth. Right, you know, right. like those, are, those are phenomenal tournaments in their own right. I don't know. They don't. They didn't count towards the PGR, though. This is the first one that's yes. starting, to, starting to PGR yes. off. Okay. This so, is the opener. That's right. So they use those tournaments for seeding, but this one is for PGR bragging rights. Let's start off Smash 4. And let's, or excuse me, Smash 4. Let's start off Smash Ultimate the right way. Let's start off 2019 the right way as we get ready to jump into this one. Bo! Whoa. Get ready to go up against Legit. This is about to be a match right here. Yes, we got Vegas versus NorCal. Legit going to be representing uh, NorCal. Yes, sir. Uh, a top Diddy Kong player in Smash 4 was able to take a set off of Nairo. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I mean, just a really great player. It actually looks like he's still playing Diddy Kong. I actually don't think too highly of the character, but oh. I mean, I haven't seen too much Diddy Kong play. Yes, and I, Legit's a very good Diddy Kong player from Smash 4, so I really am interested to see what he can do with the character. Most and definitely. Of course, Fo. Yes. Everyone mean, knows Fo. Everybody loves Fo, okay? Like, I think that goes without saying at this point. Fo. Yeah, and I'm so glad, like, Ness is really good in this game. So I'm actually really curious. And, like, Fo is really, really good in early meta. He plays a bunch of different characters. He, he usually sticks it out with Ness. That's what he did in Smash 4 for the most part. But he's so strong in the early meta. He picks up on the game so, so quick. Mm -hmm. And. He just, like, he made Ness work in Smash 4, and Ness was, like, pretty not so great in Smash 4. Well, okay, you're right, you're right. But early game, meta, he was good. Early, early meta, we weren't quite sure how to deal with them because, obviously, you had a, you know, a few more options that weren't quite present. Yeah, people in, weren't in gimping Brawl, them really well. They weren't gimping them, you know, they yeah, were fearing yeah. the PK Thunder. And, look, I don't blame you. You get hit by PK Thunder in any Smash game, you kiss that stock goodbye. The hands. But, yeah, literally, the hands. Or I guess, in that case, the head. Or the, what is he throwing <laughs> at you? The body, the hat? I don't, he's, throwing, he's throwing literally everything at you at that point. And I know Foe is looking to carry that over here in to Smash Ultimate as we jump into game at number one on Final Destination of all places. A pretty oh, interesting yes. start to this match. Yeah, we haven't really seen much Final Destination in general. Usually we do see the Pokemon Stadium too, but both these players are going to go for Final Destination. And I want to say, man, it, it, this stage is looking pretty crisp. Oh, look, yeah, this look. is a beautiful stage. This is a sexy stage. Okay. And right now, man, already Foe. Uh, Ness combo game still very, very deadly. Already Foe at 77%. And I want to point out that directional air dodge actually was a huge buff to Ness. Dude, Ness has one cool. of the longest directional air dodges in the game. Game. So now he has an instant recovery move that he doesn't have to commit into that PKT2, the PK Thunder. He doesn't have to hit himself with it oh, to recover. Oh, Wait a minute. Mix up. He said, look, if you try to touch this <laughs> banana peel, good sir, are right, you going to get shot? I could just shot. obliterate you right now. That's right. Literally 102% is not going to take too much more to get that stock taken. And right, as I say that, there is the short hop back here to close it out. Legit, not with the strongest start here, but Diddy Kong, no, not short of comboing tools himself. Oh, yeah. If he could try to get Fo off stage, he might be able to turn it into something. Good monkey foot there to avoid that PK Thunder. Dash attack into the forward air. Got him at 100% off stage here. Looks like he will use the PK Thunder to recover here, but nope, no PK fire going to connect here for Fo. And I just want to, like, Fo, like, the thing about Ness, too, is Ness has so much kill power. Oh, and the side magnet. Did you see the movement? He oh, was yes. Moving. What the oh, heck? he was moving all That's over right. the place. And I, I just really, like, Side Magnet is another big change as well. It has set knockback. Wait a minute. The Gimp with the banana. That Gimp, that gimp was bananas, literally, man. <laughs> Beautiful stuff right there. My man, legit. You know, not. I was I was a little afraid for him in the beginning of the match. Hit a lot of PK fires. You know, ate that very deceptively placed back here, but he's still hanging in there. Ooh, oh, no. The coverage coming out from Fo in the up air to seal the stock. Ness has so much kill power in all of his moves, and Fo is utilizing it to the fullest. Down there into the jab. We're going to see a Gimp. No, we aren't. Now, do you remember in the early Smash uh, Ultimate? Like, I'm talking about early, early, when we were still watching footage on YouTube and, you know, yes. at, at Nintendo sanctioned events. <laughs> really thought up air was bad from Ness. Oh, man, his um, new up air is terrible. It's yeah. not, not going to do anything. It's such a good move. And he can even do, like, drag down up air into a grab as well. And right now, we styling. We styling. No way. The combo from Foe legit gets obliterated. What was that? <laughs> Dang, uh, Ness is wild, and we got we got a crowd here today. Everybody a very big fan of Foe, and he's up on against one of NorCal's best. And dang, <laughs> Rod, come back, man. Rod, please come back. <laughs>
my heart literally can't take any more of this. My I I am my anxiety cannot take any more of this. Bo is playing out of his goddamn mind. He's playing completely out of his mind. Ness, the fact that he can move the way he does, not only throws off the point, I mean, it's throwing me off, too. I'm thinking that he's going to go for one follow-up. I think he's going to go for one conversion. No. PK Thunder missed and missed on purpose. He wanted you to recover. He wanted you to monkey flip yeah. so he can hit you up here. Just a bunch of crazy stuff. That, where does Foe get this practice from? I mean, I, no, Foe doesn't travel as much as he used to. Where is he getting this practice the from? The Vegas like, homies, man. That's People true, will always true. be sleeping on Vegas. Don't ever sleep on Vegas, man. And Foe is their number one representative. He shows off how strong the region can be. And right now, Foe is... Whoa, we got the Richter pick, Hold up, hold on, hold on. He's got Richter on deck. What the heck? I... I don't... It's... it's hold hmm. up. I okay. mean, he, he's saucing. He's saucing right now. Okay, Ooh, so he's right just, through that. He's now whipped to his advantage. Oh, the, oh, okay, I see, I see what he's doing here. I see what he's doing here. Now, he's, a big deal in this matchup is, I already can see, the fact that PK Fire outranges forward tilt. That's going to be a very big deal. Um, Legit has to be very careful of how he spaces out forward tilt because if he's not in range, Foe can just go ahead and throw out that PK Fire and get all that damage. Right, right now, yes, Legit doing a really good job setting up all these crosses. Mm -hmm. oh, making again. it really hard for him to get his PK Fire conversion just due to how long uh, you know Simon and, and Richter are of characters. Wait the a wait? second. Oh, nice. Well, ooh. Okay, try oh. him with the watch me whip. Hold up. <laughs> wait, the axe. Not going to connect the directional air dodge. He didn't have to go into PK fire there. Oh, oh wait a minute. Okay, so with the axe. Can oh, get no. The body? Oh, he's like, trying to get the body yeah. sprayed. Oh, here we go. Yeah, and right now, Fo just uses down here so much. This should be the stock. Oh. But, wow, the trade on the up Fo just keeps going on the edge guard. Just doesn't give him any room. Oh, no. That's... Oh, wait, he made it back. Wow, I, I definitely thought he was dead. <laughs> I was definitely afraid for him. I can't lie. Okay, I like what Foe's doing here, playing a little bit more. Oh, my Lord, he almost trapped him. He almost got him right where he wanted. Playing a little bit more safe this time. You know, not quite going for, like, the double PK fire. He's only going for one this time, and then yeah, like, kind of exactly. cool off with the dash attack. Typically, he'll go for PK fire, then we'll see the grab. But, of course, you don't want to run into anything that Simon or Richter's throwing out from across the stage. And I just really want to point out, Foe has such a great mix-up. Wait a minute, grabs the ledge. Not going to connect with against the up B there. Richter going to get back on stage. But, man, what is the answer for legit? How is he going to take Foe's stock? He's I at mean, 172. You know, I, at this point, you just got to play lame to win the game, man. I know, <laughs> I know. Look, I look at Smash Ultimate, you get rewarded for pressing a lot of buttons. But, man, when you're playing against somebody like Ness against Richter, press that B button, sir. Oh, yeah, you got to get all those specials out. Richter, of course, utilizing all those special moves to set up that zone right now. Foe is pushed out to the corner and legit is setting up shop the forward smash from the holy fire. God dang. All so right, man. I mean, he, only, he only took like 87. Yeah, that's right. This is kind still, of a lot, but. It, it, it most certainly is a lot, though. He's playing right now at the ledge of stage. It's not where he should be at at all. Anytime he gets caught on the ledge, it just becomes that much harder to get back. Oh, to stuff using the tether. he almost got the reach around on him. Man, literally. Almost gave that man a scoop. And right now, he just wants okay, to hit him with the tail. Air. Oh, try to bait out the oh. air dodge. Gets the falling up air in the second time. At first, you don't succeed. You try again, goddammit. Beautiful stuff right there. And the slight delay yeah. from Foe. Like, that was such a good move. And here comes the up air combos. The PK flash as well. We styling out here. We styling. We styling. We're moving in a group. He has to flash. Damn it, he certainly has to fire to show for it. Oh, yeah. And Foe is definitely a showman when it comes to this game. He wants to give you guys a very, very entertaining match and wow foe has got done like such a great job at it the exactly. axe the axe is coming out oh, beautiful stuff there i yeah, like yeah. the stall out on the recovery he knows axe does a lot of damage and does a ton of knockback and though richter simon not very comfortable going off stage they might try to do it here versus ness only because there's certain times where he's a sitting duck obviously gets the one two three dap again playing it safe yeah and these pk fires are doing so many so much work for foe because that distance you know, richter can't really do anything about it and just keep it wow and he goes away to making that safe Really, really smart stuff. Really great nest play. The back, no, going to go with the throw. throw. That time. Not yeah. going to stay out that back throw. Really good stuff. Okay. And the yo-yo. Tries to walk the dog. Oh, very, very aggressive option right there. Man. Oh, oh wait, no. <laughs> <laughs> and he hit it back. Oh, wait a minute. Gets the air dodge. No ceiling out of the stock coming out from lit. Jit, he's off stage. Going to hit by the tail. Wait, he has a jump, though. No, going to just back. go for it. Yo, this man, Fo this is actually ridiculous. Yeah, Fo is heck? all over this map. The back air, not going to seal it out. No double jump. Going right, to have to go for the up B. And he, wow, he gets back on the stage. Oh, what listen. a recovery. And then drink some of the holy water too, man. <laughs> Got to heal yourself up. Wait, right, Fo is literally demonstrating everything you can do in this matchup. The forward throw, not going to be quite at the mat. Axe will snipe him, but not going to take the stock. What DI from Fo. Yes.
But how many more of those can he survive? Okay. There's the back air, 158.1%. He's definitely knocking on Death's door. There's uh, the upper, but doesn't get all the hits. He's back on center stage. Okay, he's getting something started here. Can he take this game number two? He needs to. This is his last moment. If he doesn't, it's going to be a 2-0 here for Foe. Legit is on his last footing. Oh, man, it's, it, ain't, it ain't looking good here. Oh, oh my. my! And it went through him and still shreds the shield. The shield's so low. You know, and, and he knows the shield. Oh, and the upper will connect. Yes, man, and the the pressure.